the past week has been terribly boring. Um, I wake up, watch TikTok, watch like a season of Survivor a day, go to bed, and it's so boring. Instead of continually shoving the thoughts deep into the back of my brain like I've been doing for the past week, I've decided instead to let them come through and let them shine. And I had a thought today because my water bottle, my emotional support water bottle that I lost a lid of, but I'm gonna find it, but I lost a little bit, it's just so fucking ugly. It's like a wood pattern, like, I don't know. But I was like, you know what? I kind of want something fun and fresh and flirty. So I'm gonna paint it and make it look cute. And I am wearing a hat indoors because I had to open our windows because our bathtub just got painted and it smells like shit in here. So I decided to make it just smell a little bit more like shit because why not? I'm already feeling like I want to vomit because of the fumes. I might as well just contribute to that more. So I was gonna use oil paint for the whole thing, but that takes forever to dry and I think maybe that's a bad idea. So I think I'm gonna paint it this pink acrylic paint color. This is just like regular paint. So I'm assuming this one will dry faster. I'm thinking that I, well, I make it pink because I, all the other colors are like out of paint. And then I think I'm just gonna like put some flowers on it. Train. Maybe throw some fun designs up there and then maybe throw some sayings on it. Like that'll, oh my god, this is gonna not even go over this. Mm, this is a bad idea. Too late now. Maybe some sayings like YOLO. I mean, it's true. YOLO I feel like got too much shit. It didn't deserve how defamed it got. Like YOLO's a good saying. And honestly, why did I touch that? Obviously it's not gonna be dry, I just put it on there 20 seconds ago. Oh, this isn't a good idea. So why am I so bored? Well, I'm on break and everyone that I hang out with in my apartment is not here or they're preparing to leave so they don't have time to hang out with me and do fuck shit nothing. I think this is working actually. Nope, nope, spoke too soon. I think I'll let it dry for a few mm, seconds. I feel like I really just need to like let the unhinged thoughts just like come through. It's so much more fun when they just come out. Like if I wasn't painting my water bottle right now, I'd probably be sitting watching TikToks and that's really fun, but like sometimes I just want to get my hands dirty, a little gr ah! a little gritty, a little DIY. Even though I never do good crafts, like it's still so fun to do them in general. This is only going to get two layers, I think, even though you can still see through it and I'm just going to hope that no one looks at it too closely except for me. Also, you may be wondering, how are you going to wash it? I'm not. I'm not gonna wash it. I'm going to hand wash it. Be very careful to only wash the inside of it and the lip of it, because I'm not gonna paint the lip, obviously. No way in hell am I putting this in the dishwasher, and I don't think I ever have before. So nothing new is gonna change. And if you judge me for that, then you truly do not have a real emotional support water bottle. Like, you don't wash it. Like, you, you need the flavor of just the dirt from drinking out of it for weeks on end. That looks worse in camera than it does in real life. Jesus Christ. I'm not the best artist, but that doesn't stop me from living my dreams of being an artist. And you know what they say, all art is good art, even bad art. Something like that. Why wait for this to dry? Um, I have a little rant to say. Also, it's getting a bit darker, so I have to fucking speed this up or else I have to turn on the goddamn light. I'm, an, I'm a Dire Wimpy Kid enthusiast. I was Greg Hefley my freshman year of college like two years ago for Halloween before the fucking curve. I, I started that shit because I've always loved it. I, I watch it like every few months, all three of them, whenever I can find them online. And I was very excited about this new movie. I am a film major, but I enjoy every single film I've ever watched, so I'm not a very good one. It was so disappointing. And I just feel like, in animation, like I watched a YouTube video about it and they mentioned how like, 
in animation you can typically do more than what live action could bring you so like why would they not do more you know i mean i'm a little bit biased but that's a me issue and i'm still a wild enthusiast of children's movies like if one of your top three movies isn't a kids movie then i can't trust you and you you don't deserve to have an opinion on anything i think this is dry i feel like i can put stuff over this now like it kind of just looks like like tie-dye i think i actually have to turn the light on it's gonna look like balls Why does it look like that? I don't know if I look less orange. What I think I'm going to do is I'm just gonna keep the acrylic band going because it seems to be drying fairly quick. And that was kind of my concern that it wouldn't dry and then it would be gross and disgusting. So I think I'm gonna start with a blue. Ew, I feel like this, does paint go bad because this feels like milk. And we are raw dogging the painting process in terms of shapes and colors because what, like, preparing things makes things not fun. And I'm a firm believer in that. Wow, this one's, this is gonna be ugly. We're going with it, okay? Like I said, this is an experiment and we are just gonna do whatever feels natural for us in our bodies. Wow, I keep adding a layer and it looks more shit each time I add a layer. Okay, well, we're gonna let that sit. So right now we just have a circle and I think, I want to add some phrases onto it. So I was watching iCarly, as one does. There's this part where Spencer, like, I don't know what exactly happens, but he's like, I'm just a person. And I always thought that was a great quote. And I was like, that'd be a dope tattoo. Cause like the pretentious people will be like, wow, like that's so deep. And like, you are just a person, but it's also funny and it's from iCarly. So I feel like I could put that on here. Oop, I just touched it. <laughs> Or maybe I shouldn't paint over this and just add some goofy little art on it. I feel like I need to think this through a bit more. This is not going as hot as I would anticipate it. Like, cause it looks like shit. My handwriting's so bad. I, I write like a little boy, like a little 15 year old boy. So I've decided instead of trying to make it look cool, um, I'm gonna plagiarize because why not? Like, I'm not gonna sell this or something. Um, I'll put a picture. Shit, I already did that wrong. Um, because I, I'm not an artist and I think, I mean, I am an artist at heart, but I'm not an artist in reality. So I need to accept that. I just need to like do something simple because there's no way, cause I was like, it would look cool if I put like an octopus on it. I'm not sure if those girls outside can hear me. And if they can, that's really embarrassing. Having a little reunion outside. Ooh. Now it looks better on camera than it does in real life. So how the fuck... That one's like that one. We're freestyling. We're free bowling right now. Oh, I just touched it. <laughs> They're so fucking loud. Just like, go to the bar where we're going already. Jesus Christ. Um, I got my Spotify wrapped. And my top song was Beach Baby. I think I'm a little toxic. Like I shouldn't relate to that music as much as I do. Like I'm not a grown man that lives in a hut. Pretty swag. There's so many noises. Also, I closed the window because those girls went away and it was getting really cold in here because the sun's starting to go down. That's another thing. Fuck daylight savings. Um, I know that's like a communal agreement of an I like like everyone hates daylight savings. But I really feel like this year it's like I have not been able to adapt to the fact that it gets dark at four o'clock at all. And it fucks with me every day when I see the sun going down, I'm like, oh my god. What the fuck? Like what am I supposed to do? And nothing. Because I'm someone who as soon as the sun's gone, I'm not being productive. I feel like maybe I should have let this paint dry a little bit longer and it's just gonna get chunky and gross. You live and you lose. You live and you laugh and you love and you laugh and you live. See, it doesn't look that bad on the camera. I mean, it looks really bad, but I think it could look worse. 
and that's that's how I've just lived my whole life. Everything I wear, I'm like, you know, this could be worse. This shirt, I mean, this shirt's cute, but I'm wearing sweatpants with it, and I basically exclusively wear sweatpants. Controversial opinion. So I just can't care about fashion. Like sometimes I'm like really into fashion. I'm like, let's go thrifting. Let's hit the fucking stores. Let's like pop off on these motherfuckers. But I'm someone who I feel like I I just look bad in every, all clothes. Like not even in like a, I hate my body way, but just like a, I think I, I like was born to be like in the nude all the time. I don't know if other people can relate to that, but probably somewhere out there will. I don't. I like closed the windows like 20 seconds ago and I could already smell the paint more and it's fucking grossing me out. I don't really know if the vision is coming through at all. I don't think it is, if I'm being honest. We're just gonna put some yellow on the inside of it and then, you know, add some Sharpie designs. What the fuck? Ew. I feel like this is coming off a lot better on the camera than it is in real life. And I mean, that's like good because then Whoever watches this will think that I'm like way better at arts and crafts than I am. But it's also not as good because I have to look at it and see it's actually ugly. Also, I don't think this is what the pattern was like, if I'm going to be quite honest, now that I think of looking at this a bit more. That's alright. That's fine. Not really nailing the execution here, but it's all, it's the fun that matters. It's not about the journey. Or... It's not about the destination, it's about the journey. And I'm really holding that true to myself today because the, des the, the destination is not gonna be pretty. I thought I'd be going to the, to the beach and instead I'm going to a swimming pool at a motel in terms of my destination right now. I'm literally on the edge trying to make sure that my roommate and her parents don't walk in here while I'm sitting here. Cause like that is, that, that would be the end of me. I would not come out of my room again. It died. Tight. Good thing I work out so I can hold it up with like a, like a beast, like a beast mode. I'm on beast mode. Is the lighting gonna remain one way in this fitting video? No. I also don't feel like getting my camera that I just plugged in, so I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna hold it like this. My sister called me and I was like, oh wow, I leave tomorrow. Like I have to go pack all my stuff and I'm definitely not gonna do that until like 11 o'clock tonight just because that's so much effort oh my god this is so ugly this like didn't even help why maybe i should use like black paint actually because because what is that i also probably shouldn't have painted my water bottle because i'm like really thirsty and i don't know which other one to use this kind of looks like an egg that's fun it looks so much better on camera and that is astounding. As a student of the arts, um, technically I don't even know if that's true. I don't know if film major counts as a student of the arts, but I'm gonna pretend it is for this moment. I feel like I have the, the knowledge to say that this is post-modernism ironic art. I feel as if I'm on the track of being the next Michelangelo, perhaps, because this is truly what, what art's about. It's about getting out your expression. Like for this, it's the red is my anger. What am I angry at? I don't know, but the art knows. It's dripping everywhere. Oh my god. This is so embarrassing. This has literally gone downhill so fast. Oh my god. I'm just gonna finish this and go stick it in my room. Okay, we're done. This is it. I got shit all over my hands. So first we have the centerpiece. Actually, this is, I mean, look at that little, little mistake. Looks like a little egg. This one's a bit, more concise because it hasn't had time to drip yet and then we have my other oh and then it, it dripped down from here but i'm not even a big hater of that like that's not the worst thing i've ever seen and then we have i'm just a person at the bottom with our little egg again so i feel like this was a bit of a flop but kind of kind of a pop too 
and all the bitches at my school are gonna be like, wow, she's so artistic. I mean, everyone's fighting to be the most unique person there because it's college, but I feel like they'll just really like the egg. This is just officially the egg water bottle now because they look like eggs. Um, well, if you enjoyed my craft, subscribe. Yeah, I'm probably gonna do some more because I'm obsessed with painting things that I shouldn't. Uh...